welcome back to another video this is episode four of my journey home back north to seattle from phoenix in this video the destination i will be exploring is lake tahoe if you watched my last video episode three this is a direct continuation of that video i literally just ended that video i'm driving out of yosemite park and i'm making my way to lake tahoe now today we have three hours and 49 minutes left i've already been driving for about 40 40 50 minutes without further ado let's get into this episode In a quarter mile, keep right to continue toward Rawhide Road. So on days like this where I woke up super early, like this morning at like 4 a.m. and then walked all morning long for like four hours around the park and now I have a five hour drive. I am so tired. And so I had to get me one of these big boy Red Bulls for this drive. Right now we are driving through the middle of nowhere. We are in California countryside, somewhere in California. Uh, it's it's beautiful. I don't know where I am, but it's it's beautiful. We are officially under the two hour mark. So we are making progress. That Red Bull has me wired to the ceiling right now. I could drive for 10 hours. <laughs> still have an hour and a half left but my legs need to be stretched we've been driving for about over three hours now so i need to get out of the car do a little stretch get the legs moving a little bit oh, it feels so good to move the legs a little bit just sitting in the car for three hours look at this spot though somewhere near bear valley on highway four it's a good spot to stretch the legs i'll tell you that much Got a little tree crossing here in my flip-flops oh made it this right here is why i love road trips make a random stop to stretch your legs and go to the bathroom and it ends up being absolutely gorgeous random stops in gorgeous areas that they never knew existed that you didn't even know was there that's the best Alrighty, we are all stretched out. Ready to crank out that last hour and a half. One hour and 30 minutes left. Lake Tahoe, let's go. This is quite the pass road we got here. Just like one road, no lanes. This is like the California version road to Hana. There's no lanes, pretty narrow road, two cars going by each other. Officially under 30 minutes. We are so close. I can taste it. Oh, I'm going nuts in this car, man. We have made it. We have finally made it to Lake Tahoe. I'm gonna go check in. We'll get settled into the room and then we're gonna go check out this lake. I'm so happy to be here. I'm so happy to be done of driving. Here's home for the next two nights. Not the biggest room, but it does a trick. You know the drill. We gotta do a bed test. Oh, not too shabby. Pretty comfy, actually. So yes, this will be the spot for the next two nights and uh, we'll be checking out Tahoe. I got a glimpse of the lake on the way in and it already looks incredible. It's like aqua blue, like Caribbean blue. So I'm gonna get settled in, pack some stuff in from the car, get situated a little bit, and then we'll go check out the lake. Okay, we found the lake and it seems to be just as rad as everyone says it is. Look at this.
What? That's incredible. All right, we gotta get down there. The water is so nice. It's so blue. I feel like I'm in the Bahamas right now. <laughs> I definitely know where I'm coming tomorrow morning to do some paddle boarding. Right here. It looks so clean and refreshing. It looks so nice. So right now I'm kind of just walking around all the different spots, scoping it out for tomorrow. So that I know exactly where I want to come to tomorrow morning and waste no time, just go straight to it. So I cannot wait to come out here tomorrow and just get on the water and just take in Lake Tahoe, man. I'm so pumped. Look at that. <laughs> tomorrow morning I'll be paddleboarding on that. But all right, since I've scoped it out now, I think I might jump in. Or at least go tarps off, get some sun rays. I actually have some shorts in my backpack, so we are ready to jump in this lake for the first time ever. Fantastic. Except I don't know how to climb out, so. I should go in here or just walk in. I don't know how cold it is either, so. But either way, we're getting in, so let's do this. Okay, so I just touched the water for the first time. It's actually freezing. <laughs> I guess that makes sense. They've had all this snow melt running into the lake. Oh, no, I don't know, man. That's cold. I don't know, man. That's pretty cold. Almost just jumped in from over there. I'm kind of glad I didn't. Probably shocked the crap out of me. That's freezing. Still gotta do it though, right? Ooh, that's slippery too. Flip. Ooh. Just so you know, I'm not lying. I am in the water. Oh my gosh, it's freezing. Okay, slowly but surely, we'll work our way in, I think. Look at this view though. Okay, this looks like a good spot. We'll just dunk our heads, refresh ourselves, and officially say we've jumped in Lake Tahoe. Okay, I think I'm gonna set you guys up here so that way I don't have to worry about dropping you guys and losing you. That's a pretty decent view, I think. You guys can see me, right? So cool. Alright, let's do this. Lake Tahoe. Woo! Oh, it's actually so refreshing. It's cold, but it feels so good. Lake Tahoe. So my GoPro just died, so now I'm on my phone. But uh, I think I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of the sunset. And I'll see you guys back in the room. Made it back to my hotel room. Got a new battery in the GoPro. It's gonna be a boring rest of the night. I'm just gonna get ready for tomorrow morning and then hit the hay, get some rest. We'll hit tomorrow strong. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It is a beautiful morning here in South Lake Tahoe. It's about 9 a.m. now. I've already woken up, did some morning reading, had some morning coffee, just enjoyed the morning to myself. And now we are all packed up and heading back to the spot that I scoped out yesterday. I got my paddle board, I got all my goodies, and we are ready to have a paddle boarding session this morning. Let's go have a glorious Friday morning. A day the Lord has made, I rejoice in it. Hallelujah, amen. 
Let's go have some fun. All right, we are back to this beautiful, beautiful spot. I'm trying to show you guys. So uh, we're gonna get the paddleboard out. We're gonna have to hike down there and then we'll pump it up and get out in the water. Let's do it. Gotta get on the sunscreen. Can't be getting burnt out here. And we are off. Walking down to the lakeshore now. It's a bit of a hill. going down that but it will be well well worth it I cannot wait and it is also so incredibly beautiful out here it's, un it's unreal <laughs> there it is that's where I'm going to be paddleboarding today. That doesn't even look real. <laughs> oh man, I'm so stoked. Let's get down there. Look at this. This is unbelievable. I'm gonna paddle over to these rocks and go check that out. Look at this water. And look at this beach. And look at this plane. This is absolutely ridiculous. Tahoe is incredible. I can't even put into words how beautiful this is. I mean, just look at this. It's just cove after cove of Caribbean water. Look how blue that water is. I've never seen anything like it. Lake Tahoe is something special, man, I tell you. This is just unreal. I am tempted to never leave this place. Just stay here for the rest of my life. <laughs> this is insane. This is just literally so, so cool. I love it. I love it. I think I might try and jump off these rocks over here. We'll go land ho and do some jumps. There's the vessel parked. Let's go explore this little island. Okay, it's super rocky right here. I was hoping I'd be able to jump off, but I don't think this spot will do. I might have to look for a different spot. But I mean, look how beautiful this is. I feel like I'm Jack Sparrow out here. 
in the Caribbean blue, just paddling my vessel. It's fantastic. And then after this, I'm gonna go back to the beach, I think, and just post the chair up, man, and just keep soaking it in. This is my one and only day here in Tahoe, so I'll just be hanging out here, taking it all in, man. Soaking it up as much as I can before we continue the journey north. So, I mean, this is, I wasn't expecting this. I really wasn't. Okay, so I'm gonna hike out real quick, back to the car, and I'm gonna grab some food. I just finished a 24 hour fast, so I'm breaking fast right now. And I'm gonna have some protein oatmeal. <laughs> then I'll bring some snacks out with me and a chair. So I can just hang out on the beach. I left my paddleboard down there, so hopefully nobody takes it. Can't imagine anyone wants to steal that, but let's get some food. Whew! Made up the hill. It's quite the hike out of there, man. Takes your breath away. Boiling water for our trusty protein oatmeal and a banana. Just a good hearty meal to break the fast. Cheers. Already gone. Round two. So good, oh my gosh. And a trusty banana. Alrighty. That was scrumptious, dumbly-umptious. Back down to the beach we go. Back to the glorious sun rays. Just soaking in the beauty of Lake Tahoe. Man, this is a great day. Fantastic day, I love it. God is good. God is great. Hallelujah. Just look at the way the water looks from up here. I don't know if you can tell in this GoPro, but it is magnificent. Paddleboard still here, that's good. Time to set up the chair and just soak up the sun. This pump is great, I gotta get on. I only have a power pump. So I'm just hanging out, sitting in my chair, taking in the views. So I'm just gonna continue to do this for a while and then uh, I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later. Go jump off of this. Hmm. Is that the way up, just through here, or around yeah. that way? I guess you can get up on the other side, but some of these guys went up where the right here. Okay. Yeah. It's kind of a you guys yourself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you. This lake is truly, truly unbelievable, man. Like I said, I did not expect this. I am thoroughly, thoroughly impressed by Lake Tahoe. The water is so clean, so fresh. It's clear as a bell. It's blue, it's like Caribbean blue. It's a little cold, but in this weather, how hot it is, it's so refreshing. 
Nashville. I'm so happy I stopped through here. This is awesome. I'll definitely, definitely be coming back to Lake Tahoe. Heck, I might not even leave. <laughs> I might just call my parents and be like, hey, I live in Lake Tahoe now. So, sorry, come visit. <laughs> okay. I'm all packed up. Now I'm hiking out of here. This is definitely the least fun part of it. <laughs> but, it was so worth it. But now, I'm packing out. I'm gonna head back to my room, kinda get cleaned up a little bit, and then grab some food. And then I might go check out some shops, some gift shops. I gotta get a sticker, probably get a coffee mug, probably get a hat, all the goodies. And then, I'm thinking I'll come back out here for sunset. One last little shebang for Lake Tahoe, so, and wish me luck for hiking out of here with all this stuff on my back. Because <laughs> this hill is steep. Whew. I'll see you guys at the car. You guys get to skip the hard part. <laughs> Alrighty. We made it. That hill is no joke, man. It is steep. But we powered it out. We got it done. I'm gonna get this stuff packed into the car, head back to South Lake Union, then we're gonna go look for some goodies. I'm gonna go down the road to the village, South Lake, South Lake Tahoe Village. I'm gonna check out some shops. See if we can find a sticker, a hat, maybe a shirt or a coffee mug. I don't know, I'm just gonna go check it out. Probably not gonna bring you guys to that. But after that, I think I'm gonna come back here, get some stuff together and then go back to that same spot as last night and watch sunset again. Cause it be my last little shebang here in Lake Tahoe. Let's go find some souvenirs. We're gonna go, we're gonna go be a tourist. Alrighty, got done shopping, found some goodies, got a t-shirt and a hat and a sticker. That was successful. And now I'm heading back out to that spot. I'm gonna grab some food and do like a little picnic style sunset out there. So, so let's get out there. Got my camping chair, got my dinner items. Let's go enjoy a good old sunset for the last night in Tahoe. Got some little sliders. And just enjoying the view. The sun is almost down and it is beautiful. It's like one of my favorite times of the day. Look at this. What a great way to end my Tahoe visit and with a beautiful Tahoe sunset. Woo! Back to the car. So, that was the last night in Tahoe. Beautiful, beautiful sunset. A beautiful, beautiful place. Incredible lake. I really enjoyed it here. It was a lot of fun. Now I'm just gonna head back to my room, get ready for bed, get some rest, and uh, we're waking up early tomorrow morning and heading north. Continuing our journey north to Seattle from Phoenix. Yeah, we'll be getting up early, getting an early start because we have six and a half hours on the road tomorrow. I am dreading it, but we are heading all the way up to Crater Lake. So I'm gonna get home, get ready for bed, and get some rest, and we'll see you guys in the morning. Goodbye, room. Thanks for having me. Parking lot coffee. <laughs> Bye, Lake Tahoe. 
Lake Tahoe is officially behind me. It is officially in my rear view mirror for my journey home. That was a spectacular place. I really, really, really enjoyed it. So now that Tahoe is behind me, I'm continuing my journey north. My next destination is Crater Lake National Park in Oregon. I'm gonna end the video here. So as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. So yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.